Hey everyone, welcome back to Legend of Mushroom with Genghis. One of the things I want to talk to you about is long-term planning in the game and specifically how many items you need to upgrade, what you're going to get out of it. It's one of the things I specialize in these games is saving money by doing that. And anyways, we're going to take a look at Mount in, in particular. Uh, our Discord, our website, Reddit... All of it has great information and on the website, and you can get to it through our Discord, which many of you are a part of. We did also have a cash giveaway this past Sunday, question and answer. We gave away 25, 15, 10, 10, 10 dollars, five different cash prizes for people who attended the question and answer period, ask questions in the Discord. If you'd like to do so, we're doing a question and answer every week, every Sunday. We uh, won't have the cash giveaway every Sunday, but it will be once a month. And uh, anyways, it, all these stars, all these different tiers, what will you benefit from? How many gems will it cost? Because I just bought 2,000 uh, clock winders right here. And, you know, that's probably, I don't know, will that get me four stars? Will that get me five stars? Will it get me two stars? I don't know, but if I go to this website, it will tell me exactly how. We're going to go to it in a minute. Just also want to point your attention to the code at the top, MUSH5. It is an Aptoid code. You will save an extra 5% using it and up to 35% depending on your VIP level with Aptoid. So definitely use it for in-game purchases, save money. And long-term plan. Now let's get to it. So looking at this, you can buy clock winders. First thing you need to know, you go to the shop down here. You go over to the kind of looks like a clock, pink clock winder sticking in there. And you can buy them here. I just bought actually 70,000 gems worth. And I was thinking, I was like, man, how many gems is it going to cost me to get to tier 8? Like I would love this feather, but... Oh, is it? I got to get to tier nine for the feather. Wow. I thought it was tier eight. I just get the broom again. Okay. But anyways, I want those buffs. That's really what I care about. So how many will it cost me? I'm at tier seven star one. And all I can see is 7,835 that I need. So if we go over to the website here and at the top, you can see the name of it. Legend of mushroom.net. You can go to it. It's free. And you go to the homepage, there's all sorts of different stuff in here, different links about us, Aptoid, guides. Let's go to guides for today. And we're going to go to the calculator. So this is the mount calculator. And my man, Corey, who's made all this stuff, he is great. He has stuff for everything in the game. I'll once in a while uh, show it, but he has like how many wing tokens, what are these called? Feather coins that it takes to upgrade each of these levels from like one to 60, one to 80, all that sort of stuff. He has basically everything you could think of, relic, how much does it take to get to the next level, that sort of stuff. Let's get back to the main event here. So I am level mount tier seven. I wanna go to, I'm currently star one. My desired level is tier seven. And let's say tier star five now corey i i love you brother but you gotta change these colors these are hard we got to make these easier to see so if i click on it it goes white but to zoom in you can see it really right here so i need fifty six thousand four hundred and seventy clock winders you could also put how many you have in your inventory if you're going to spend on this game, spend responsibly. Use the Aptoid App Store. It's got all the best in-game purchases. They fight for market share with Apple and Google. That's why they offer these discounts. Use promo code MUSH5 and information of how to download this is in the description to the video as well as in the Discord. My needed clock winders went down 10,000. So it's at 46,470. So I need, so I'm not going to get there. Let's see. What can I actually get to? How many did I have here? I have 23,000 if we include the 2,700 that I already swiped in there. So 23,000. Okay. So I'm, I'm, I need 20. Oh, no, no. Because I accidentally have 10,000 in there. Oh, looks like I'm not going to be able to get there. 
star three. So can I go up two levels? And if I have zero in my inventory, 22,000, yep, I can get there. Or I can spend 770,000 gems if you're buying them at 35,000 a pop for 1,000. So it looks like I need 22,000 to get to the third star. And I have that many uh, clock winders. So it looks like my star level will end up right there. And maybe, maybe by the next event I can get to there. But it looks like I'm probably going to be about two or three months away from getting to tier eight looking at that. So anyways, I just thought this was super cool. Corey added it today. I told him I'd do a feature on it, let everybody know. Uh, hopefully you guys appreciate all his hard work. Join the Discord, use the code MUSH5 and like, subscribe, leave a comment.